the only city with multiple definitions. A green city in the sun, the heartbeat of the country. The regional's business hub, name them all. Nairobi is the only among the world's capital cities that boasts of a national park. Only a 20 minute drive from the city center, you get to meet the world big five at the Nairobi National Park. And which other better place would have the Nairobi Miss Tourism take place? Deep in the jungle, top contesters from Nairobi were up for the task to prove their worth as in the modeling contest. Nairobi Miss Tourism finale attracted a huge crowd with 30 beauty pageants taken to the stage. Actually the theme is celebrating Nairobi in the wild and that's why we chose to come at the KWS in Nairobi National Park so that we can make sure that at least Miss Tourism goes on with uh, making sure that we, we also preach about conserving and especially the big five to, uh, to extinct, uh, we, we, so that we don't get them to extinct, extinction. With a natural setup, those who turned up got to enjoy the world as well as the magnificent beauty of Nairobi pigeons. This was all in the spirit to conserve the wildlife and environment. I'm more concerned about the environment of Nairobi. An initiative was formed by the, uh, the late Honorable John Michuki to clean up Nairobi River. And parks were built, recreational parks were built, and trees were planted across the river. This has been a huge deal and it has made Nairobi River a tourist attraction in Nairobi. Miss Tourism is operating on five pillars. The first one being tourist attraction, and then we have environment, and then uh, natural resources, and then we also have beauty of the people and investment. But then what we're planning to do after this event is uh, make these girls to be the ambassadors of various programs. When in terms of con conservation, we're hoping to have ambassadors of the big five. I think our people have actually deserted the environment, which is a very strong pillar. Despite Nairobi City County hosting the headquarters of tourism, the county government shunned the event with the governor Dr. Ivan Skidero with his entire office, neither turning up nor registering his apologies. County chiefs alongside other Kenyans have been challenged to see to it that they package tourism in a unique way, so as to be at par with neighboring countries who are giving Kenya a run for her money in tourism business. You have to sell Nairobi. Sell it as much as you can. Nairobi is not, it's not only about the tall buildings, but you have a lots of beautiful things about Nairobi. We have to tell people to keep Nairobi clean, keep our rivers clean, even our streets. You know, when, you talk, when we talk of environment, you talk about everything. We need to keep it pollution free. I think we as Kenyans, we need to come up with ideas that are unique compared to other countries around and I think for us to rise in terms of competing with other countries around us such as Tanzania and Uganda then we need to find unique ways, new ways on how to sell and market our tourism sector. At the end of the five hour event a calm but confident Evelyn Wagaki, tag number 13, scooped the top prize. Each and every one of us should adapt like an animal in the sense that these animals are being put such as the white rhino there's, there's the elephants, all of these animals are being pushed because of their hearts. So if people would just adapt an animal and just give like even 50 bob a week to help and to help control this anim this poaching and, and just rear this, the young ones of these animals, then I think we'd have a greater population of the wild animal. She was crowned Miss Nairobi Tourism and she looks forward to boost conservation in Nairobi, even as she looks forward to contest for the Miss Tourism Kenya crown in a couple of days to come. The lady who is going to represent Nairobi County at the Miss Tourism 2013 uh, at the finals that is slated for 30th November. I'm just smiling for my environment because I believe it will never be the same again. Henry Miner, GBS News.